how to safely put up a real live Christmas tree. Make sure this year's live holiday tree is not only pretty, but safe too. You will need a fresh tree, a tree stand, water, a ceiling hook, a piece of wire, tree lights, and blue masking tape, optional LED tree lights, and a heavy gauge extension cord. Step one, choose a tree with fresh green needles that don't easily fall off when you shake the trunk or run your fingers over a branch. The drier the tree, the bigger the fire hazard. Needles should bend but not break, and the trunk should feel sticky with sap. Step two, ask the tree vendor to cut two or three inches off the bottom so your tree will better absorb water from its stand. Step three, choose a spot for the tree at least three feet from a radiator, fireplace, heating vent, or other heat source, and don't block any exits with it. Never light candles near the tree. Step four, put the tree into a tree stand filled with fresh water as soon as you bring it home and keep it watered. Don't skimp on the tree stand. Use a sturdy one that will keep your tree straight. Step five, with a piece of wire, attach the top of the tree to a hook in the ceiling so it can't tip over. Step six, use tree lights made for indoor use. Check for damaged sockets, missing bulbs, and frayed wires before hanging them on the tree. Consider upgrading to LED lights, available where other tree lights are sold. You'll spend a bit more, but they're safer because they don't generate heat. Step seven, tape down any loose cords so people don't trip over them. Use blue masking tape to prevent paint damage. Never run cords under rugs, it's a fire hazard. And don't attach more than three light strands to an extension cord. Use heavy gauge extension cords. They stay cool and don't fray easily. Step eight, if you have young children or pets, keep breakable ornaments out of their reach. Step nine, when the tree starts losing needles, take it to a recycling center. Dried out trees account for hundreds of fires each year during the holidays. Did you know Benjamin Harrison was the first president to display an official White House Christmas tree?